coming, they coming, they coming, hit the button, hit the button. Young world, so an official cause of death has been released in the Daphne Unger situation. And let me say this, I put the video up two days ago. I got a lot of backlash on that video, a lot of dislikes, a lot of negative comments. Let me just say first and foremost, condolences to the family, to her family. You know what I mean? It wasn't my intent to try to be in no conspiracy stuff. I didn't make the video for conspiracy theory's sake. I genuinely thought, which I did, if you clearly see, you see the camera move. Some people saying it's her cat. Some people saying she kicked it or her phone rung and vibrated and made it move, whatever the case may be. But Joker, you seen the phone, you saw the screen move. That's all I was saying. I'm not saying that definitely somebody was there with her and did something to her. That's not even what I'm saying. I just raised the question because I seen the phone move as she was being recorded. So that that's that. And like I said, condolences to the family. No disrespect was intentionally meant for the family. And also this right here, if you some gematria with the situation, if you type in Shannon Claire Spurl death, because that's her real name, Shannon Claire Spurl. But if you put that into the gematria calculator, it gives you nine one and two different ciphers, septenary and Chaldean. And she died on September 1st is what they're saying. 9-1 September 1st and it gives you two different September 1st on there so you're gonna see that's a conspiracy too I mean that's that's just what the numbers are saying you know what I'm saying it could be a coincidence or whatever the case may be but um, it'd be hard to find another person named Shannon Claire Spurl I would think but that's what it is that's it's, like I said condolences to the family it wasn't no harm was meant to be and um, that's about it